Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video will show you how beginners can use AnyDesk on PC, laptop, or any other device. Are you new to AnyDesk? Stay tuned because this video is for you. So first thing you need to do is go to AnyDesk.com. I repeat, that is AnyDesk.com and click on the download now button in the middle of the screen. But first, let's look at the pricing and rates of AnyDesk services. Each pricing option has its own perks, and the more you pay, the more extensive their services become. And as you can see, each package has a, a myriad of uh, terms. And as you can see here, access and control, you can see uh, it's very different for solo, free, and the other two. As you can see, this the, the free version, you can barely do anything, but the... Standard and advanced options have a lot of really good options. If you scroll down, you can also see the free version where there's a link to get started. And yeah, as you can see, uh, you have support, you have the disable audio uh, update, uh, auto update 24 7 support, uh, live chat tickets, a help center, phone support. Uh, you have all of this from the solo, for pretty much for, for, for the paid versions from solo, standard, advanced, and ultimate. Ultimate is you need to contact the company itself to set that up because that's yeah that's 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 very boosted so as you can see here this program is available for windows mac and other devices once you've downloaded the installer the process is pretty straightforward as well Now that you've installed and opened AnyDesk, you can see here the dashboard. You can connect your other devices to AnyDesk like your phone as you can see here. Once it's done connecting, you can see that we can easily maneuver through this mobile device. Via our any desk via our any desk on the computer. The thing about this to take note is that you can't click on any of the installed apps. You will need to do this via your phone. After this, if you want to fully utilize your any desk trial, you need to click on the start trial license over here. It will ask you to fill out the standard information like name, email address, password, and so on. You can also have a trial period using the business trial, which has more features than the standard one. The difference is that business trial version needs approval before you can use it. Back on your AnyDesk dashboard, you can click on a new session on the top left corner like so. It's pretty much the same, like a different tab for a different session or project, which is pretty neat. So that's how you maneuver through AnyDesk as a beginner. Hope the video helped. Like, comment, share, subscribe, ring that bell icon, and we'll see you on the next video.